brought to you by Hair So Fly Shop. I'll be sure to leave the link below to this wig and also their direct store. This wig been out for a while now and I always wanted to try it but I just needed time to really go in and try this like because I wasn't ready. So I got the straight texture and the color is so beautiful the way the color just fades into the other color you never thought it was a synthetic wig this is what the inside of the wig looks like you get two combs towards the front another comb in the back with adjustable straps and you get no lace to cut this is how the parting comes with this wig I did not go in and pluck it and I'm not going to go in and pluck it So underneath the wig for the parting, I did not go and apply any powder or anything for it to blend. I just have on a nude wig cap. This is what the hair looks like straight out of the box. It comes straight. And in this video, I would like to show you guys how I usually curl my wigs, like my synthetic wigs, or if I'm in a rush with like my virgin hair wigs, I just throw a few curls in really quick. This really helps. This is like less than... Uh, 15 minutes like it's so fast but it depends on how fast you move so the flat iron that I will be using for this tutorial is a Revlon flat iron I got this flat iron from Marshalls a few years ago it was super duper cheap about $16 and I was like wow this would be the perfect wig or my synthetic wigs if I ever want straight or any curls because the temperature don't get too hot and you have control of the temperature so for this I have it on number 15 to me when I see 15 it stands for like 150 degrees or something like that so yeah that's good so when curling the hair I just take my time and this this is what I do like I just slowly curl the hair away from the face and work my way down by like crimping the hair so I'm like clapping the flat iron while I turn it at the same time so the heat could kind of hold it in shape I hope you guys really understand what I'm trying to say. So throughout the video, I'm not going to really talk. Hopefully you guys watching will help and hopefully be like self-explanatory. Um, I get this question a lot. Like, how do you curl your hair with a flat iron? It's a flat iron. Isn't it meant to just straighten hair? No, a lot of flat irons could actually do some wicked curls, you guys. Like, you would be surprised if you really take your flat iron and try a curl and be like, whoa, hold up. So I really hope this helps. Um, just sit back and enjoy. And, you know, if you have any questions, feel free to pause, comment, or wait by, until the end of the video and ask. And I'll try to get back to them as soon as possible. Later, you guys.
right here is my end results after curling the wig and right now I have it as a middle part but I'm not really feeling it as a middle part so I shifted it to the right kind of like how Black China had hers when this came out because I feel like this color was kind of inspired off for her but yeah I like the right side part way better and this is my end results the curls came out nice I didn't spray anything on it if you want you could go in and finger comb it and all that stuff later on I go in and like comb it out with a wide tooth comb because I wanted like a wavy loose look nothing too tight with this hair color and yeah but the hair color i love how it fades into everything it looks very nice as for the density the density is on a medium side this wig is big head friendly the length of this wig on me is about 20 to 22 inches my height is 5 6. a lot of you are probably like but this wig comes with curls like you don't have to get the wig straight you always go buy the curl option or get it wavy honestly it's just something about those wigs that look really thicker than the straight wig in my opinion so i thought it would be nice for me to go in and do my own curls this is just the option the texture of this hair is on the silky side as for tangling i did get a few snags in the beginning but after that it came right out and shedding shedding was medium i don't know why i didn't go in and pluck it or cut it or anything so i don't know why the shedding is so big but hopefully over time that stops and that's it so feel free to comment let me know your thoughts i tried my best with this wig this is for the ladies that got this wig and just want to try to see what it looked like see you guys in the next video later guys